what is going on guys? This came back from Redlands, California. That's roughly around two hours away from where I am in San Diego and we picked up new wheels. And these new wheels are something that I've always wanted but it is not for my car. It is actually for this car. And believe it or not, we are revealing this car in the next video. I'm revealing what car is under here. I will give you guys a tip, it is a Civic. It has been sitting here. But it is a Honda Civic and I will show you guys. I mean, it's, yes, it's just another Civic, but Civic, my brother didn't want to show anyone. Only a couple of my friends actually know about this car. It actually used to be at the track. He attended the first ever VTEC Club event with this car. Yeah, I'll show you guys that in the next video, so stay tuned. But we did pick up new wheels for this car and I'm gonna test it out my car and check it out. Spoon SW388s. Now, these are not Rotor Grids or these are not Ambits. Wait, what the fuck are Ambits? Okay, but yeah, these are Spoon SW388s, uh, it's also known as Desmond Regamaster Evos, but these are Regamasters. Let me show you guys. There you guys go. Uh, focus, focus, made in Russia. These are, what is it called? They're forged, fully forged, and this car used to actually have spoons on it and Silver Rega Masters, so this is his third sets of Rega Masters or spoons or whatever you want to fucking call it But we're going to be putting this on his car in the next video That's why I'm gonna reveal this car in the next video There's a lot of good things about this car and I really miss seeing it on the road But it'll be back up on the streets at the end of this year probably I will tell you guys all about the plans that we're gonna do for this car We're gonna pretty much rebuild it so it'll be a new new car for the channel It'll be new content and everything But I really want to mount these on my car because I am planning on going 16s on the Civic that, I, well, my Civic. But right now I'm running the 15 by 7, 35 offset T37s with the 225, 45 uh, RS3s. But I might be changing that to 16s soon. The only reason why I stayed with 15s on this car, and especially with TEs because they're light, because I was running the single cam and I wanted to have no problems with the motor pulling at the track and everything. That's why I got light wheels at 15 inch. But since I have the Type R motor in it now, I could easily just run 16s, which I could easily run these. Oh yeah, these Kosei's are for sale. Kosei K1s, they're 15 by 7 plus 25 offset if I'm correct. These are the version 2's. And it's been sitting out in the car for I think 3 years. No, not even 3 years, 2 years and a half. But they will be for sale after we put the spoons on this car. But right now, I'm going to test fit the spoons on my car because I feel like it will look really good. I'm not sure about the black, but I feel like it will look more aggressive with black wheels. And they did come with metal hub centric rings for Honda, so it's a 56.1 uh, hub, hub bore size, which is for EKs and Integras. So they'll fit like really centered. And it came with brand new, well almost brand new, he said there's only 4,000 miles on it. Uh, Yokohama S-Drives 205 45 16s. And there's a lot of meat on them, and we're gonna be selling these tires if any of you guys want them. They're 16 inch uh, S drives. We're gonna get new tires for the tire or new tires for the spoons first, and then get rid of these. But all right, time to test fit. I'm really excited. I love the bronze, but I might test fit the bronze on his car. Put the spoons on the car. They look so good. I'm kind of jealous of my brother getting these. I kind of actually do want to buy these now. So I might end up looking for a set. And these are 16s, so they fit the car a lot better. And I'll probably, I don't know, I'll probably just leave it like that if these were mine. Yeah, they look really, really nice, especially with the Wildwoods. Damn. If you guys think I should get a set, let me know because I feel like I should buy a set of these and 16s and they look amazing on my car. I kind of like them better than the TEs. I mean, the TEs are nice, but the spoons, I think it sets off the car a little bit better. I was never too fond of black wheels and I wasn't sure what this car would look like on black wheels. I thought this car would look a lot better with white wheels because of the delivery, but with the black spoons, they look amazing. The rears are a little sun because these are 16 by 7, 42 offset. But I can't complain, they look amazing on the car. And the T's are on this side. The T's do look good on the car, but the spoons <laughs> look way better, honestly. But yeah, <sighs> gonna look for another set. Probably in 16's also for my car. 
these are going on this car which I will reveal in the next video or maybe this video who, who knows I think these are by far the best wheels that like I would ever own or like that I love to own like TEs of course this is my second set of TEs this is my brother's third set of Regamaster spoons or whatever you want to call it like I said so many new names for these but I'm gonna clean these up tomorrow and then we're gonna put it on the car that's under here and check out this uh, Jay's racing to hook you guys probably you know it's an EK uh, OEM SRR front lip but Jay's racing to hook got that got powder coated black but we'll show you guys the rest of the car tomorrow this car was one of my I guess inspirations I we used to go cruising a lot in this car when I was younger and I didn't have a car and then yeah, but now we get to cruise with each other soon, really, really soon. You guys can see that it's white. But, I'll show you guys tomorrow. But overall, this is just a little, a little small video. Going to be working on the car, on this car tomorrow. So I'll record that for you guys, of course, and the review. And I will be installing this wide band sometime this week. Or maybe tomorrow. Most likely I'll do it tomorrow. But... Um, I still gotta order a single din radio for my car to use the black off plate, but I might just wire it and then just leave it somewhere for now until my see if it comes in, or until I figure or figure out which single din I want. A lot of, I already posted on Instagram, but a lot of people love it, and I fucking love it. So this is just gonna be the thumbnail. All right, time to go for a little drive. Not on these though. I gotta put the T's back on. Until next time. Oh, well, until next video. So. Peace out, like, comment, subscribe, and stuff up to you guys. And thank you for 5,000 subscribers. Hopefully I hit 5,000 subscribers by, by this video. Hopefully. But yeah, do a 5K giveaway soon. So, peace out.